By 2035, the United States will, for the first time ever, be a country that has more older adults than children. By that time, here in Clark County, more than 25% of the population, or one in four residents, will be 60 or better. The Clark County Commission on Aging provides leadership, advocacy, community awareness, and develops partnerships to initiate positive change toward an all-age livable community. To tell the story of the Commission on Aging is to tell a story that involves change, community caring, and growth. It's a story of how over a decade ago, some very committed and forward-thinking people uh, heard about statistics about the number of people that were going to be aging in Clark County and decided to do something about it. In 2012, the county commissioners adopted an aging readiness plan in which more than two dozen people from across the county evaluated the community's readiness for an ability to serve a quickly growing number of older residents. It was developed in 2012 with a task force of about 24 members and had significant uh, public involvement as part of that adoption process. And the five chapters in the existing plan cover community engagement, healthy communities, housing, supportive services, and transportation. And the updated plan will add a new topic of emergency preparedness. The Commission on Aging is currently updating the Aging Readiness Plan. As a part of that project, three interactive public workshops were held to help refine existing strategies and brainstorm new ideas for the updated plan. We have learned how truly interconnected we are as a community. It's really interesting because we really do have a great deal of communication between agencies um, and with citizens within Clark County. But what COVID-19 had shown us was that there are a number of gaps and those gaps seem to in fact grow in information sharing and sharing of resources within the community between these resources and between uh, and the residents of Clark County. The update will refresh the plan to address changes in the last 10 years, um, update the data and maps that are in the plan, and ensure that new technologies and services are included. And one example of that is uh, rideshare apps. Those have been uh, more popular in the last 10 years, and they're an alternative method of transportation for older adults. And overall, we're working to update the plan so it's current, relevant, and uh, we can begin implementing it. The updated Aging Readiness Plan is expected to be presented to the County Planning Commission later this summer and finally before the County Council for adoption. We have several concrete next steps. Uh, in July, we heard uh, from our consultants um, about our finalized aging readiness plan, um, thinking about the changes and incorporating in the changes that we heard during our many workshops and conversations with the community. And then in August, uh, our aging readiness plan will be going to the planning commission where there'll be workshops and then discussion about the aging readiness plan. And then it will be presented to the county council, we hope in September for passage there. For more information about the updated aging readiness plan, Call 564-397-2280 or visit the website.